As Hurricane Nicholas makes landfall in Texas and Louisiana recovers from Hurricane Ida, UAPB football players reflect on how these tropical storms change their own lives. The storm just kind of washed out the city, but my family basically came back to nothing. You know, just to see, you know, our house, you know, kind of flooded, you know, losing everything basically, so. Quarterback Scour Perry and wide receiver Tyron Ralph are New Orleans natives, winning a state championship together at Edna Carr High School. Long before these two connected for touchdowns, their families tried to make ends meet as they picked up the pieces following Katrina. Man, I was five years old, but I was knowledgeable of the situation that was happening. So we kind of lost everything during Katrina and we, we gathered what we can. And we was blessed to leave two days before the storm actually touched the city. I actually relocated to St. Louis, Missouri. Some of my family actually never came back to New Orleans. I was about you know, five, six around Hurricane Katrina, you know. My family and I, you know, an extended family, we all stayed in, you know, one hotel. Ten of us in a room, you know, we just playing games. You know, as kids, we don't really know too much. I didn't know what to do as a kid, so I was just, you know, trusting my mom and my dad, you know. Then I ended up relocating in um, Alabama for a year. The Golden Lions finished their spring season as runner-ups in SWAC. Wow, the speedsters, he's got the Jets! UAPB is in the spotlight this fall, looking for a conference title and playing the Razorbacks. But Perry and Ralph have another source of motivation as their families are affected by Hurricane Ida. In this moment, my family is still cleaning up their houses because a lot of things have molded out and things like that. Power and all water as we speak. But a lot of my family thinking about relocating for good. I'm kind of disappointed and you know sad that Hurricane Ida happened because I didn't want you know this thing to happen again. You know, everybody, you know, still getting back on track from that, you know, first hurricane. While their attention is still back home in New Orleans as families heal from Ida, Perry and Ralph's focus remain on winning in Pine Bluff as a storm of their own is brewing in their chase for a SWAC title. I kind of put those things to the back of my mind, you know what I'm saying, that keep me motivated and make me want to grind even harder. You know, that's extra motivation on my back, you know, kid from New Orleans, you know, things are still going on. We kind of have to represent for them, you know, out here in Arkansas. So, you know, everything is going to work out for the city. And I'm, you know, I'm praying for them and I hope everything works out for everybody. UAPB visits UCA this Saturday and later faces Arkansas at War Memorial on October 23rd. Nick Walters, Fox 16.